Hey, so it is day two in New York and yesterday was such a fun first day that we had, first night. Um, we totally loved both the restaurant and the lounge that we went to and now we're ready to get this day two started which is gonna be a long day. Right now we are getting in our Uber, we're gonna head to uh, Harlem, start there and then work our way around. Right. Catch up with you later. We made it to Sylvia's in Harlem, and there is some bread sitting right in front of me that I cannot wait to taste. Hold on, hold on. Ooh, it smells so good. It's nice and warm. It's good stuff, guys. And so we chose to sit right outside to get the whole neighborhood feel of Harlem. Ah, my blouse just got stuck on something. So yeah, I can't wait to look at this menu and see what they have here and try some of this good food. Sylvia's is supposed to be some of the best soul food, so I am ready for this. Oh my god, you guys, look, I just got my food. Look at this. All of this goodness, that chicken. It smells delicious. And take a look at this mac and cheese. I mean, can we get some mac with the cheese? <laughs> All that cheese. Oh What'd you get there, Felicia? Well, before I messed it up and put it all together, <laughs> sunny side up eggs, grits, and chicken. Yum. Oh my so goodness. Sylvia's world famous chicken is definitely worth the world famous. So I'm about to try this macaroni. I mean, look at this. Look at this. Mm. Oh my god. You guys, this is so good. So freaking good. Checking in with you. I excuse my shiny nose. It is has been so hot out here right now. It feels like a breath of fresh air. It's sorry. I always do that. I'm like always <laughs> all up in your face. Um, it feels nice. Like it feels a little dewy still, but um, there's like a nice little breeze. Oh, I just felt that right now. <laughs> um, but yeah, so it feels good right now. And we just spent like a whole afternoon in the neighborhood of Harlem which was really cool we got to visit a couple museums and uh, you know just check out the neighborhood and stuff like that and now we have crossed over to the Bronx so we are on um, Arthur Avenue in the Little Italy area of the Bronx and we're gonna try some pizza from this place it's a pizzeria called full moon pizzeria um, this is gonna be our first time trying some New York pizza so I'm like pretty excited about that um and i i have a huge sweet tooth so i want to try a cannoli like you know for real cannoli from from new york yeah 
Alright, so we're here at Full Moon Pizzeria and I am trying um, two types of pizzas right here. We've got air spinach and artichoke. Look at all that. It looks so good. And then right here is a pepperoni and sausage. I've never seen the sausages like this. Um, it looks so good. And of course, I saw the garlic knots and I just had to do it. Look at that. Oh, they're so like soft. Can't wait. All of this goodness right here. But I'm, yes, this is my world. <laughs> I'm looking for one thing and one thing only, and that is the cannoli. <laughs> Let's see. Ooh, those are always good. Oh, yes. There are my cannolis right there. Yeah. And I think I want to try this too. Italian rainbow cookie. Look at this. Oh, we got our goodies here. Of course, I had to get me a cannoli. Can you believe I've never had a cannoli before so I'm super excited to try this I like that they had like a little teeny like two bite size kind of cannoli um, this right here is a walnut ball and then this is the um, oh my gosh what's it called rainbow cookie duh it's different colors <laughs> um, we we're right down the street from the pizza place that we tried um, and this is let's see mo oh gosh Marone Maroni <laughs> pastry shop and co cafe um, and this is on Arthur Avenue in the Bronx so mm, look at that uh, oh my god <laughs> wow I didn't even mean to bite off half of this <laughs> almost Tastes like it has some cinnamon in there. I don't know if that's like a normal thing or if that's just the way they make them here. But I like it. Uh, mm. This kind of tastes like that, um, what's it called? Amaretto or something like that. It reminds me of like the biscotti, biscotti, whatever you want to call them, cookies. It has that exact taste. Mmm. I'm not an amaretto flavor fan. But I like this. This is good. It's light. Not too sweet. Okay. It's Hillary approved. We got tempted by this little girl with her shaved eyes. And we decided to come and get some also. So we're going to have the lemon ice. Here we go, guys. Mm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Let's go right there. This hits the spot and is perfect for after dinner. Light, nice and cool because, you know, it's still hot and humid outside even though it's, what, like 6, after 6 o'clock. It is still hot out there, so this is perfect for right now. He's getting a little extra footage. Getting in with you guys, um, Bronx area, uh, back in Times Square where we're staying. And so it is um, now the evening time and we decided to come out. We haven't really been like around the local area like near our hotel. So um, you know we've just been like exploring outside of Manhattan. And so we're out here um, just you know looking around, um, taking in the sights and all of Times Square, uh, looking at like um, vendors and like gift shops and stuff like that. Um, see if maybe we can find some goodies to take home with us and we have a vendor that has some really cool stuff um, Look at this guys. This is super cute. I love this. You can't even really see it that good. The phone doesn't video doesn't really do Okay, maybe you can kind of see it. All I see is myself in the reflection. Um, but yeah, it's like kind of 3D-ish. Ooh, that kind of looks better. 
but yeah this is like a super cool frame love that and they've also got like all these really cool photographs um fashion themed hey guys just checking in with you it is the very end of the day actually it's already the next day <laughs> it is no longer sunday but now monday morning maybe just after one o'clock or so we had a very long eventful and fun day um as i mentioned earlier um I went through the bronx area um tried some pizza some desserts and stuff <clears throat> And then we kind of toured around the little touristy thing through the Times Square area because we hadn't really Didn't done that yet. This gift shop in the Times Square area. I cannot remember what it's called. I cannot remember. But it's three floors. The main floor that we literally felt like we spent spent like two hours in <laughs> um, was crazy they had every imaginable thing that you um, could think of they said bought a few York. things from there um pretty decent prices on mostly everything um you know a lot of places especially in times square can be really expensive um, and many things it was surprising um so yeah um and i have <laughs> my drink right here that is so good it's basically like a pina colada, but I don't know what else it has in your hair. I really can't remember, to be honest with you. All I know is, so, um, so yeah, the main floor, they had so many cool and cute things. Oh my God. It was really hard for us to, you know, like not want to buy the entire store. Well, me anyway. My friend Felicia, on the other hand, damn near did buy. <laughs> um... <laughs> and i did pick up a few things but before i get to that so main floor had a bunch of different things um upstairs they had like a sports sort of new york theme stuff as well as kids stuff and then downstairs we did hit up the kids section but downstairs we did not get to it because we had already spent like way too much time in that store and we were just exhausted already <laughs> um they it was like a 99 cent souvenir area or something which i wish we had seen um in the first place but but um after we did our shopping we just you know came back to our hotel got some thing to eat we were starving at this point and had a couple of drinks now we're back in our room trying to relax and to get ready for tomorrow um i have some work to do but then it is on to more adventures but before i let you guys go for the night let me show you the few things that i got so for my son who is five um of course you know i have to bring him home a couple of goodies and so i found this super cute t-shirt look at that let me see hold on let me get it right okay so it's like a smoky blue color i thought this was really really nice um and you've got you know all of your sort of new york staples there um let's see we got the uh, like sort of streets of new york with like the taxi cab um the street signs um what is that empire state building statue of liberty the Flatiron building and all of that good stuff so i think that he will really like that and this was only $9.99 like that's honestly not bad even for a little kids t-shirt you will find this at a different store for like 20 bucks minimum and then what did i get also for him is this little snap bracelet i know you guys remember these from you know when you were a kid he's been wanting one of these um i don't know where he saw this where like he wanted one all of a sudden but i decided to get this for him and i think it was like $2.99 or $3.99 so you know and his favorite color is green so this is the i love new york and that and i got a couple things for myself okay, i got this super cute little keychain 
that has, hold on, let me get this right. Let me show that to you. So it's a little age, of course, for Hillary, and it's got your, let me see, hold on. New York. Statue of Liberty, see that? And then it's got a, oh, hold on. <laughs> so it's got a little apple there. Sorry, it's coming out blurry. And then it's got a little taxi cab too. How cute is that? And this, I think, was $3.99 maybe. So that's not bad. Again, something like that at a different store might cost you like $8 to $10. And they have some really cute magnets. They had like magnets galore. Okay, like every, again, every imaginable thing. <laughs> Size, shape, color, whatever. They had it. And this one just really, really drew my attention. I love that. Um, and look, $3.99. Cute. And the very last thing that I have here. Oh my God, they had so many of these little glass things with like, um, I guess like little pictures or whatever. Um, of New York and like the different um, landmarks and things like that. Uh, I don't know if you guys can really see this that good. Kind of. Hold on. Let's see. I don't know if you can see that that good. But anyway, it's got the, you know, New York buildings in here. It says New York on the bottom. And then on the very bottom here, you can see it from like every angle. It has the little buildings on the bottom too. So this was so cute and it's like really miniature it's so cute they had so many different ones and this i think was how much was this like maybe 5.99 i think 4.99 5.99 3.99 way! yeah the little ones were 3.99 3.99 for this super cute little takeaway souvenir thing i mean i'm telling you the store was crazy crazy so, yeah. cheap for a lot of things all right so that is it um might do some more shopping tomorrow i don't know i'm gonna try to be good but you know not me <laughs> no definitely not her well you know you're gonna have to be because you have spent <laughs> way too much money today okay i'm gonna have to watch her <laughs> Um, so that is it for today. Drink and just lay down and knock the hell out and get ready for tomorrow because it's gonna be another long day, but it's gonna be exciting. It's We've had so, so much wonderful. Fun so far. We have thoroughly enjoyed New York so far in our first day and a half that we've been here. So 